know, we get asked a lot about why the urban monk has a name, and yeah, for me, uh, for me, that name really encapsulates some of the the values of the business, which are about traditional, slow, simple, um, high quality. Yeah, and also just acknowledging that there's something really special about food, and that we should, yeah, that we should treat food with respect. And um, you know, food brings people together, um, and food nourishes us in all sorts of different ways. We have also got a really strong value over, around environmental ethics, and. Um, yeah. My work before this, and actually still at the moment, is in sustainability at the University of Canterbury. And, but I've been involved in the organic sector for like 20 years in New Zealand, and um, it was really important from the very beginning that we make sure that this business is a certified, fully certified organic business. The idea is to support the organic community and also to support those growers who are making the effort to be certified organic. So it's actually um, the only the only certified organic uh, sauerkraut made in New Zealand and this little mark here this um, fully certified by OFNZ organic farm NZ um, mark is the consumer guarantee that that's what you're getting a fully certified organic product and it has Moses on there too so just as an added little bonus I had been involved in an organisation that started up after the Christchurch earthquakes called the Food Resilience Network. And when we were mapping out <coughs> what a food resilience system for Christchurch and Canterbury would look like, we talked about you know, all the different elements, the growing, the distribution, um, so, you know, shops to sell in and that kind of thing. But one of the big gaps that we found in that whole food ecology was uh, processing. And I thought, ah. Oh, I wonder, I wonder what I wonder what it would look like to fill that gap. So yeah, so it started trying out different things and and found that there was an appetite for cultured foods which I really liked making. Now we're we're selling product all over the country from Auckland to Dunedin and um, yeah, supermarkets have just started selling as well. One of the things that would really help us at the moment is if our customers would ask their, their local shops um, to stock our products. Mm -hmm.